Hi, this is Subhash. Today I am going to explain about the intermediate first year uh, board topic, locus. It is in the uh, four marks in the board exam. Uh, what is meant by locus? The set of points in a plane which are at, uh, uh, moving at a constant distance from a fixed point is called the locus. It is different from the uh, all segments. Here, uh, any circle is moving like this. The set of points means these are all the set of points. These are all the set of points moving in a plane which are at a constant distance from a fixed point. Here we can take any distance from P to A. Here three units. I am taking this as three units. Then we can take the, all the distances. E is three only. P to A, P to B, P to C. P to D, all the distances here are all equal only. That is the P A is equal to 3 only. This is called the locus. It differs from the, if any two lines are passing through like this. Distance of these two lines is 2 units. Distance of the lines is 2 units. Here also satisfying that condition. Set of all points. The set of all points is moving in the same distance, two units only. Here the condition is PA is equal to B. I can take PA is equal to B, PA is equal to two units. Here the geometrical condition is two units. Here the geometrical condition is PA is equal to three. It is satisfying such geometrical condition. According to the data, we are finding the geometrical condition, then we can solve it. Here, first we have to uh, mention, here I am going to explain two problems here. Uh, these are the first problem and second problem. Find the equation of locus of P, X, Y. Here, the given points are A, B. Those two points are joining from A, B. Here, we are finding that, uh, find subtends a right angle at P. Find the equation of locus of P subtends at right angle at P only. That means P is the point at right angle only, here only. P is the point at right angle means here only. Those two points are 2 comma 3 minus 1 comma 5. Here we are, they are saying about the three angles. That's why I draw the triangle. Here the condition is PA square plus PB square is equal to AB square. Why means this is the right angle triangle. That means one angle is must be 90 degrees. That means this angle is 90 degrees at, at P only. Therefore, condition is PA square plus PB square is equal to AB square. Here, we are using the PA means distance from two points. Distance of two points formula under root of X1 minus X2 whole square plus Y1 minus Y2 whole square. That means here, we have to substitute these values here. We can get the answer. Here, x1 minus x2 whole square. We can apply the formula here, a minus b whole square. That means a square plus b square minus 2ab. Here, apply this formula, you can get the answer. Solving this, you can get the answer only here. Similarly, here also one more problem. Find the equation of locus of the third vertex. Here also they are saying about the angles only. Third vertex. Vertex means this is the vertex. This point is here, they told about the find the equation of locus of third vertex. We are finding the third vertex only, but they gave the hypotenuse endpoints. This is the hypotenuse. This is the hypotenuse. Endpoints are 0, 6 and 6, 0. Why we are taking this point as 0, 6 and 6, 0? A point lies on x-axis, y-coordinate is 0. A point lies on y-axis, x-coordinate must be 0. That's why 0, 6 right here and uh, write the B point 6, 0 only. Here also we are finding the third vertex. Third vertex, that means P only. Here, condition is here also same condition. Right angle triangle. That means sum of the sides whole square is equal to hypotenuse square. That means PA square plus PB square is equal to AB square. Applying this formula, you can get the answer. Here, you have to present this problem as let P, X, Y be any point on the locus. For this, they will give the one mark. After that, given the geometrical condition, according to the data, you have to write the geometrical condition. That is, according to the data, we have to write this. And given the geometrical condition is, then we can write this. Then, substitute these two values, you can get the answer. This is the main content in these two problems. Uh, this is the third problem. 
here we are finding the locus of the P, area of the triangle is 9 only. Area of the triangle is 9. That means we are finding the third vertex here also same, but they gave the two points only. If you want to find out the area of the triangle means we need to, we know the values of three vertices, but they gave the 5 comma 3, 3 comma minus 2. But they gave it area of the triangle is 9 only. We are finding the locus of P at condition is area of the triangle is 9 only. That means here P x comma y be any point on the locus, all problems are same only. But here area of the triangle 9 means here half into x1 into y2 minus y3 x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 is equal to 9. Here substitute these values here. Therefore x1 means here x comma y only. x2 y2 x3 y3. x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3. Substitute all the values here is equal to 9. Solving means we can get the answer. Here we, we have to know about the value is here we are finding we know the value of only area of the triangle formula only that is half modulus of x1 into y2 minus y3 x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 is equal to 9 they gave it only here we have to substitute the formulas here x1 y1 x comma y only x2 y2 x3 y3 substitute all the values here and is equal to 9 cross multiplying you can get the answer only similarly this is fourth problem distance from the p to the points here points are 2 comma 3 2 comma minus 3 are in the ratio 2 is to 3 that means here they gave that p point is the distance from p to a and p to b only we have to understand like this only before then they gave the data only Read the question thoroughly, then you can understand easily only. They are saying about the distance from P to the points. That means P to this point and P to this point are in the ratio. Ratio means X by Y or X is to Y only. Therefore, here also same we have to write the PX comma YB any point on the locus. Here geometrical condition, GC means geometrical condition is PA by PB is equal to 2 by 3. Here cross multiplying. 3PA is equal to 2PB, squaring on both sides. SOBS means squaring on both sides. 3 whole square 9, PA square, 2 whole square 4, PB square only. Substitute the values here. PA square means apply the distance formula. That means X1 minus X2 whole square plus Y1 minus Y2 whole square under root of. Substitute the values and cross my here. Multiply the value here only and here you can get the answer only. This is a fifth problem. Distance from P to the A is twice the distance from p to the b is minus 3 comma 0 minus 3 comma 0 only here also same let p x comma y be any point on the locus write the same here we have to find out the geometrical condition what is the geometrical condition here p to the a p to the a is twice the p to the b only p to the a is means equal to therefore p a is equal to twice means two times two times from P to B only, that means PB only, squaring on both sides, PA square is equal to 2 whole square 4 into PB square only. Apply the formula PA square, distance formula under root of X1 minus X2 whole square, Y1 minus Y2 whole square. Here also same, X1 minus X2 whole square, Y1 minus Y2 whole square. Here the point is P, X comma Y means X1, Y1. X2, this is X2, Y2. Here also same, X2, Y2. Solving means we can get the answer. Similarly, next problem, they gave the A, B, C points only, but they gave the geometrical condition. Directly they gave the geometrical condition, that is PA square, PB square is equal to 2PC square. Here, show that equation of locus. Here, they are saying about the answer. They gave the answer, show that means we have to show that value only. 7x minus 7y plus 4 is equal to 0. Here, they gave the condition PA square, PB square, 2PC square. Therefore, here let P x comma y be any point on the locus, same only. Here this is the x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3. Similarly, if you take the P point is x1, y1, here this is x2, y2. P x1, y1, x2, y2. P x1, y1, x2, y2. Substitute all the values here. Here also same distance formula x1 minus x2 whole square, y1 minus y2 whole square. Do not square here. 2 square 4, you cannot write this. Why? Because they gave 2 only. You cannot squaring. 
in the previous sums squaring on both sides means two will square only but here not like that they gave the two only you can write the two only multiply with the two only here pa square pb square two into multiplication here also you can multiply with the two solving this equation you can get the answer 7x minus 7y plus 4 is equal to zero uh, geometrical here all the problems are depend upon the geometrical condition only here all the problems you have to write the let p x comma y be any point on the locus from the given data, we are deriving the geometrical condition. Therefore, given the geometrical condition is write it only. Sometimes they told that uh, given the end points of the hypotenuse, at that time PA square plus PB square is equal to AB square. Sometimes they will give the distance from P to A is equal to twice the distance, at that time 2 into PB. Similarly, they gave it the another problem. Uh, directly they gave the geometrical condition similarly all problems are like that and one more thing area of the triangle at that time we have to remember this formula half modulus x1 into y2 minus y3 x2 into y3 minus y1 x3 into y1 minus y2 is equal to they will give that value and substitute all the values we can get it similarly all problems same method only here you have to remember the formulas PA square plus PB square, PB square is equal to AB square only. Similarly, area of the triangle formula, you have to uh, compulsory, you know about these formulas, you can get the answers very easily. This is the next problem. Find the locus of A comma B. Here the condition, they gave the condition directly. PA plus PB is equal to 8 only. Here also we are finding the equation of the locus of P. Here PA plus PB is equal to 8. Here PA is equal to 8 minus PB. Take the value from here to here means it will become plus value. It will goes to outside of the equal to means minus only. PA plus PB is equal to 8 means P8 minus PB only. Plus value move from here to here. It will become minus only. A minus B all square formula. Here squaring on both sides. PA square is equal to A minus B all square. A square minus 2AB plus B square. A square, B square or minus 2AB. Substitute the values, you can get the answer. Here taking the PB square here only, PA square minus PB square. Here you can get the easily answer. Similarly, here one more problem. Sum of the distances is 8, 6 only. Sum of the distances is 6 only. That means PA plus PB is equal to 6. Therefore, PA plus PB is equal to 6 means PA is equal to 6 minus PB. Similarly, sometimes they will ask the difference of the distances. That means PA minus PB only. Whenever they ask the sum means add the value. Whenever they ask the difference of the distances, at that time we need to write the PA minus PB is equal to 4 only. Take the value there, it will become plus only. A plus B value here. Squaring on both sides, PA square is equal to A plus B whole square. A square, B square, 2AB only. Substitute the values here. Take the PB square here. PA square minus PB square. Applying the PA square formula, that means distance formula only. Under root of X1 minus X2 whole square plus Y1 minus Y2 whole square. Here also same. Here solving, we can get the answer. Here, uh, in the conclusion last, equation of the locus is you have to write that for that only they will give the one mark scheme of valuation they will see the pro forma like that first you have to write the let p x comma y be any point on the locus for that they will give one mark uh, given the geometrical condition for that they will give one more mark and after the substitution of these values you can get the answer for the last conclusion they will give the one mark for this means you can get the four marks according to that here, these are the main problems. I covered this all uh, in this locus chapter. If anything, uh, more problems, you have to practice on that. You can get easily understand. Thank you very much.